Hi there, welcome to this short video for a basic user via your mobile device. Enter your four digit PIN number to log in. This user only has access to and can view timesheets, jobs, and scheduled tasks. However, the admin can change these permissions for the user to however they like. Firstly, we'll look at timesheets. A basic user can view their timesheets from previous weeks, selecting the arrows or select actions. We will jump back to this week. They can also add time to their weekly timesheet by selecting the plus sign. Now we'll look at jobs. Here is the jobs list. A basic user can only view jobs in their associated files. They can apply filters by any of the following options. They can also filter jobs by their current status. Selecting actions gives the option to view jobs on a map. Because this user has limited access, they can only see what you have given them access to. Select the job to view its job details. This user can't add any charges to the job. Select actions. This is what a basic user has access to within the job, and this is what you've given them access to. Select scheduled tasks to view any tasks assigned against the job. To view and add photos from the job, select actions, then photos. To view and add scribbles from the job, again, select actions and then scribbles. To add a timesheet entry for the job, select actions and then add timesheet entry. Select a labour rate. This user can't see the labour prices as the pricing permission is turned off. Enter time via duration or a specific time range and then select next. Enter details of the timesheet entry and then save. The timesheet entry is now saved to that date. Select a day to view a weekly timesheet detail. Go back to the main menu and select scheduled tasks to view the tasks assigned to the user. Again, this user can only view tasks in their associated files. Select one to view its details. Select actions to add and view files or add timesheet entry. Again, because this user has limited access, they can only see what you've given them access to. Select about to view version history and check for updates. Select your inbox to view your messages. Select actions to send a message, mark all as read or view sent items. Select log out to log out of your next minute account. Thank you for watching and I hope this has helped. Please see our knowledge base for more how-to videos and articles.